Alright guys, so here's just a quick tutorial on how to get your PS5 sock locked. I know I haven't made one of these uh, videos in a good while, but uh, I was playing, was playing some Black Ops earlier, or at least trying to, because my internet went down for a little bit. And I decided to play on my favorite map, Micro. I, I love this map. And I wanted to go up against 18 bots. This is what I do. So I, I set everything up. And then I start the game. I'm not going to start the game because it will basically do the equivalent of what happened in the last video. Except you can hold down the power button on the uh, on the PS5 and it will fix it, but it, you could risk uh, corrupting some of your data. And I think I could have done that with the last one, because I was re-watching the video, I was just pressing it, I wasn't like holding it down or anything. But yeah, that's how you can soft lock your, uh, your PS5. Just play Call of Duty on micro in an offline match with 18 bots on the enemy team. It'll put you on their team you know what? I'll show it, I'll show it. That's what happens. Instead of closing the game, you'll see what happens with the, with the game. It'll say connection error at the bottom. It gets all freaky. But yeah, um, I'm, I'm actually going to try something different to see if I can completely avoid this. From happening if I accidentally do this again. Oh. Oh. Oh, well, that's no. Huh. <laughs> well, it looks like instead of. Oh. No, no, it, it still soft locked it. Or at least my equivalent. It this it will be it will be oh shit. It will be stuck at thirty seven percent until the end of time, because it doesn't know what the hell fucked up. So you have to turn. You have to hold down the power button on the PS five to to fix this, which I will do now. All right, so we're gonna. Go ahead and press the power button, or hold it down for a few seconds until you hear the second beep. Wait. Oh, I thought it actually, okay, well, you might actually only have to do one. One puts it into rest mode, two, uh, two completely shuts it off. And we'll see what happens with rest mode. If, it, if that doesn't work, I'll just hold it down until it does the second beep. And it usually takes a while to, uh, to close when this shit happens. I don't know if this is how long it normally takes or if it's just specifically when, uh, when you soft lock it like this. I'm gonna keep calling it soft locking. I know it isn't soft locking, but, you know, it's, it's good for the title. There it goes. So as you can see, the TV screen is completely off. The, well, the light is still blinking. It turned blue. It's gonna go orange. You can kind of see it. Uh, so I'll try and turn it back on and see what happens. It's probably gonna say, it's probably gonna give me the corruption menu. Where it says, your USB extended hard drive has been... Huh? What? Well, that's interesting. That's a... Uh... 
It's gotta be a way to like. No, I can't. N nothing's working. None of the buttons are doing anything. I mean, I can unmute and mute myself. Oh, that's working. All right, so yeah. You do need to, uh, wait until the second beat to turn it off. Now, even though that'll get rid of the glitch, it will, uh, it will mess with the PS5's data a bit, or could, it could mess with the PS5's data. And since I have this two terabyte extended, uh, two terabyte extended hard drive, it could also corrupt some of the data on that, which would not be fun. So yeah, once it turns off, uh, I will end the video here. I, I don't want you guys to wait. Once the screen goes black and the light on the PS5 stops blinking, you can just resume whatever the hell you were doing. You know, turn, turn it back on using... Actually, you can't use the controller. You have to use the power button to turn it back on, uh, but then you can go back to not playing Micro on Black Ops 3 with 18 bots on the enemy team. Well, with that being said, if you guys enjoyed this video, like, and if you really enjoyed, you can subscribe. I'll see you guys next time.